all you flight simmers out there, Commander Kingfish here, and I am back in Microsoft Flight Simulator, and we are back in the Unalaska to Kulik Lake bush trip. And so we are on leg 11 today. We're almost done. Uh, we've got uh, 50, point, well, 50.5 nautical miles uh, to fly. Uh, we're going to King Salmon today. We're leaving Egot uh airport you get uh, alaska and we're going to be flying up along the coastline and hitting uh, the big river and then following the river up and we should be coming in on this runway right here uh because we'll be coming up the river so i will uh go ahead and get this started and i will see you over in the cockpit here in just a little bit Okay, I am over here in the cockpit, ready to go. As you can see, we've only got like two points of interest coming up. And as I said, that uh, there's our airport that we're going to be landing at. Uh, so we're going to be taking off he from here. It looks like we are facing out in this direction. So when we take off, we're going to swing around and then uh, come uh, over to uh, this point right here. And we should be able to see that on the ground, make our turn, and then pretty much head straight uh, along that uh, course of uh, 17 degrees for almost, uh, well, almost 29 nautical miles. And that should put us right on the river, and we'll be heading up the river to make our landing. So let me go ahead and get this uh, started. Uh, I'm probably not going to say too much because there's really not too much to say. We're going to just be following the coast, and it is uh, pretty much a um, uh, tundra, just kind of what you've been seeing. So let's let's go ahead and get started here. Get this thing going up in the air, so we can get to King Salmon. Now I do know that there is a lot of charters, resort, and when I say resorts, uh, fishing resorts or fishing camps uh, out of King Salmon. So that is kind of a popular destination. It is a uh, rather, I don't know if it's a large community, but it is a uh, uh, heavily fished area because I think there's some uh, commercial fleets out of there uh, it is one of the world's largest uh, sockeye salmon runs and it uh, uh, has uh, I've seen a lot of advertisements for uh, uh, fishing trips up to there so let me go ahead and get this uh, started here we're gonna get flying and I can get things adjusted up uh let's see make sure i got my flaps all set and if you look at this point right here is what we're heading towards and then we're going to turn and start following up along the coastline and so i'll go ahead and hop outside the uh, cabin and you can uh, enjoy the trip up
Well, we have been flying along. Uh, again, we left down there at the uh, Ignick Airport, uh, and we've flown along. We flew along that large stretch along uh, uh, Kovacak Bay on up to uh, our where we made our turn. Now, we're following the Neck Neck River up, and you can see our airport is right there. So I'm going to go inside the cab uh, so that we can start uh, getting lined up for this. We should start swinging around here a little bit uh, so that we can pick up our airport. And there it is right there. So let's start easing off on the throttle a little bit. And let's get lined up here. I can't imagine this being a very populated area, but I do know, again, as I was saying, it's uh, very popular for uh, fishing. So let's uh, get a flap down. And we're starting to get, uh, looked pretty good, actually. Let's uh, throw another flap. And let's just kind of cruise right on in. I can only imagine, I think from the standpoint of landscape and stuff up here that it's reasonably accurate uh, knowing what I know about the interior and how the tundra looks. There's not a lot of trees to speak of. It's going to be mostly all tundra up here and uh, kind of peat bogs and things like that. So uh, 500. not sure it's a place I'd want to live, but I sure would be interested in visiting there, but I don't think I'm probably will ever get the opportunity to do that. Uh, but I can't complain. I got some, some really tremendous salmon fishing where I go every year up in Alaska in the interior. So, all right, let's, uh, start paying attention to flying. And okay, level off. We kind of slow down a little bit here. Okay, not too bad a landing, actually. So, hop outside the cab and let's see. I'm not sure where we want to stop here. I think the taxiway is all the way back. So, you know what? I think we're just going to pull off over here to the side. And get off the runway here. And let's just uh, stop right over here. It's kind of a nice view anyway. All right, so... That's leg 11, one leg left to go. So uh, yes, we are ever so slowly getting through this. Again, uh, it's uh, 12 legs and that was leg 11. So that was King Salmon. So the next one takes us to Kulik Lake. All right, 
all you uh, flight simmers out there, if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It really helps out the video. And please subscribe. It'll really help the channel out a lot. Ring that bell. It'll let you know when I am uh, uploading new videos, and I'm doing that on a pretty regular basis. Okay, all you flight simmers, keep those smooth landings coming. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here, and I will see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.